hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of the lion quest and we are here in front of the tree as always and i'm standing on some stuff that wasn't here before in the last episode i've been busy i've been super busy and bam sturdy house <laughs> i think this turned out great um it's really small and simple and i started up some tree farms and some some maze farms right here uh, this is the maze that I was talking about in the last episode that you can use to turn in the thatch to use in your building and it also drops corn when you break it which you can cook up into popcorn and I haven't done it yet but we will soon. And I also found out that you can do some stuff with hyena bones other than all the other things that we can do with hyena bones <laughs> um, but we can turn it into hyena meal and I'm assuming it is like bone meal so let's see if it works on this no it does not work on this let's see if it works on the trees Do all the trees bro no there's some trees over here all right can we bone meal trees this is for science it looks like it's making particles hmm I don't want to waste any more bones though because these bones I I've gotten a bunch um, and I'll show you how I got them in a second uh, but let's take a sleepy sleep first and take a look at our new our new humble abode. Um, it's pretty simple and small, but I like it. We have a little storage area over here and a crafting table, furnace, and a little seating area to eat our delicious popcorn. Yes. Um, we can look outside and see the nice view. Over here is a little seating area, and then here I have some unfinished rooms. Um, maybe we'll think of some things to do with them. And then over here upstairs is a cool little little bedroom area so let's take a sleepy sleep since it is night time and we don't want to get eaten by hyenas and all the other scary things um, but let us let's cook up some some corn and we can make some popcorn and I think what you do is you just put it inside just in the corn fashion and Will it blend? <laughs> will it blend? What will we get? What will we get? Popcorn! Yes! Alright, so we have some popcorn. I'm not sure how many hearts um, it will give us, but we'll let that cook over there and we're gonna go look at something else that I've been working on because I am a little busy, a little busy bee working on some things over here. Um, it's a little dangerous on the outskirts, so let's be careful. Um, but if you remember in the last episode, I think it was, we found a hyena dungeon spawner room and we got some really cool loot and we have a spawner. So over here, I, I made our little derpy, <laughs> derpy grinder. Um, I did try to make an elevator grinder where you dig down and then go across and then go up and then it drops down somewhere and makes them one hit or so but hyenas do not like to go swimming upwards <laughs> uh, I couldn't get them to go I'm not sure if it's just because they're not a vanilla mob and they don't they do not go that way or if I just said something wrong but um, that's okay uh, I didn't make a little derpy derpy uh, what is it an altar <laughs> an altar for our hyenas so we can ooh, they can kind of hit us but we can hit them over here and they're, they're dancing we should make this into like a theater we can have like hyena theater because you know this is the lion king show we need to get here with tickets uh, but yeah so we can get all the bones that we ever wanted and i have been grinding out some bones so we only need a couple more we only need a stack and then we can complete our quest so we're gonna do that right now we're gonna get a full stack of 64 and my sword is about to break, but that's okay because I, I got some extras in here. And let's see. Hello? Let's see, I think I. I normally I just stay up there. So let's stay up here for a little bit. And we can wait for them to spawn. And I didn't I didn't fix that. Maybe I should fix that. Alright guys, it's been a couple minutes, so hopefully we'll have enough hyenas down there to to get enough bones. I think we only need a couple more. Uh, I think we have a chance to drop more. Ooh, side broke. Good thing we have more. Good thing. I just prepared. What? Sword is not broke. 
I don't understand. Alright, so give me your bones. We need this for science. Rafiki wants to get us a stick. Food. Give me those. Alright, we have a full stack. Yay! I'm so excited. And some extra. Oh man, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Is there any more? Any more? Alright. Okay. I'm so excited. I wonder what he's gonna do. Uh, and what he's gonna say. So let's go to Rafiki's tree and see. We gotta do this. We gotta do this thing. Oh, and we do we do have some hunger. Maybe we'll wait. We'll wait for a couple more haunches to eat our popcorn. Actually, the rest of our popcorn should be done. Yes. All right. So let's take that and see if it's a good food source. And um, another thing when I was making the dungeon room, I was like, hey, I don't have any iron. How do I make a bucket? And I found out you can make these vases like this, and you can fill it up with water, um, like right here, pride stone jars. And it's just with the the pride stone, the normal stone around the area, so we can make these, and we can fill them with water, and we can fill it with milk. And I think zebra milk um, will calm down lions, so if you accidentally hit them or something, uh, you can feed them some milk and they will be your friend again. And you can also use them as vases, um, like these. And I do have a couple out in front of my house, and I think it looks pretty and beautiful. And I have one, one up here too, a couple up here. So oh, that is so cool. It makes a nice, nice vase texture, and yeah, you can you can put trees in them and flowers. It's amazing. Oh, more corn, more corn. We need all the corn. I don't know why, but we want it. Hi. That's my house, not yours. <laughs> um, but yeah, so let's make our way up to the tree. Actually, I have these. Let's go. <laughs> oh, what? I got another hyena hat. Awesome. Oh yeah, we can decorate those in our house. We do have, I think, a couple more in there. So decorations and oh, these shoes, these zebra boots of awesomeness. Um, I might. I wonder if we can build on here. Maybe I'll put some half slabs so we can run up here faster because I'm assuming there'll be a couple more quests that we have to do and this is this is a long way whoa world's getting messed up but hello hello Rafiki how are you today D what what did you say what did you say to me <laughs> um but yeah so what do I do I just what okay here you go if you want one again bring me another stack of hyena whoa <laughs> Bring me another stack of hyena bones. All right, so we can get more than one of these sticks. And, okay. Um, we have his stick. Guys, we're doing good. Look at it. Um, let's see, does he have anything else for us to do? Oh, he says, I hear Scar has returned to the Pride Lands and he has trapped our king in the new Star Realm. You must find Scar and kill him. Ooh. My stick is the only weapon that can harm him. What? Star Realm? I think Scar is in a cave somewhere nearby. While well, Scar lives, the Pride Lands are in danger. You need to kill Scar. He's a danger to us all. Alright. So, we need to kill Scar with our stick from Fiki. Um, so let's see, what does our book say is updated? Rafiki's quest. Find and defeat Scar. Alright, so we need to, to find a cave. Oh my god. I think you have a problem. I might have to find a doctor for you. I think you have a problem. Alright, so he's in a cave near... Really, dude? <laughs> really? Okay, so a cave nearby. Um, I hope it's not the cave that we made our dungeon in, because that, oh crap, whoa. Well, that worked out well. <laughs> that worked out well for us. Um, yeah, so I guess we're going to go exploring and looking for a cave so we can find and defeat Scar with a stick. Mm, and, uh, let's see, I wonder, I wonder how far he can be or where he is. That was very cool. Alright, so it is nighttime, so let's sleep really quick and let's go in here. No, 
It is, it's nighttime. It's totally nighttime. Uh, let's see. Uh, if I do remember, we did get some silver from the, the dungeon over there. So, I think we have enough to... Where did I put my heads? There. Now we have... Oh, this one's the same. The sack, yeah. Maybe we should decorate. Where should we put our heads? We can make, like, a trophy room. Should we put them here? For now? Oh, that's cool. Okay, where else can we put them? I don't know. I don't know. I think there's three different ones, and then there's a skeleton one. So, yeah. Maybe we'll make, like, a little trophy place to put them. Um, but, yeah. So, let's see. What do we... Yeah. So, where's that silver? Silver. So, we should be able to to make our giraffe saddle yeah silver we only need two and we have rooms back hide we do have enough so i'd be thinking we should make a saddle <laughs> uh we can get our own our own giraffe yeah giraffe saddle um i did see these we can make giraffe ties um you can make different colors so rug whitener rug dye. Hmm, maybe we'll just go with the standard. Let's see, how do we make rug dye? White for a rug with the rug dye. Yeah. Interesting. We'll have to figure out. Um, I just made the yellow ones, which are really easy to make because you just use the line for it, but we'll figure out how to use dyes. And we will... We'll make some time. Actually, let's just make a yellow tie. I wonder if we have enough lion fur left over. We do have two. Alright, so we need one more lion fur and we can get a tie for a giraffe. And I'm not sure if we have to tame the giraffes and I wonder if they eat wheat or something. We'll see. Alright, so let's take a sleep and we can go and find a giraffe and we can go look for the cave of Scar. The Scar Cave. Um, all right, so you want to hear things. No, 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 go away. Actually, did this stick do stuff? I don't know. Oh, yeah, oh, I ate something before. I wanted to see how much this filled up. Well, it filled up, like, one and one-fourth, maybe? Hmm, that's pretty cool. All right, so let's go get a, actually, yeah. We need lion fur, so let's go get a lion, then we can get a giraffe and then we can use our giraffe to search for a cave yeah all right so giraffes hello all right there's some what they're on top of the tree you guys you guys are silly i don't think you belong up there what are you doing don't break a leg um mufasa i'm sorry all right so now we have another piece of leather and we can make a tie. Let's do that. I really want a tie. I'm assuming it's for the giraffe, right? You put a tie on a giraffe, so let's do it. And bam, giraffe tie. Oh, that is so cool. All right, so here's a giraffe. Giraffe, will you be my friend? Let's see. Okay, so it fills up like one and a half. That's not too bad, because it's really easy to get. Alright, so will you wear this? No. Can I wear this? No. How do you wear it? Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> um, alright, you hate me now? Let's see. Can I, can I? Alright, oh, cool, cool. Alright, so he has a saddle on him. Will he let me ride him? Who rides pigs? Alright, can I control him? Um, no. <laughs> I'm not controlling him. Oh, crap. All right. Oh, okay. Um, will you eat my wheat? <laughs> and, okay, problems. We're having some problems. <laughs> Maybe he's just still mad at me. Maybe he'll calm down. Maybe I have to give him some help. <laughs> calm down. <laughs> um, let's see, will you eat seeds? Can I eat seeds? Do you eat seeds? Right, I can't feed him. I can't feed him anything. Maybe this was a mistake. 
this, this is a mistake. We done goofed. <laughs> we done goofed. We have a mad giraffe. He doesn't like us. Um, hmm. How do we... We can't... We can't do anything. Should I just let him calm down or should I just... I wonder if we get our saddle back. If we kill him. <laughs> should we kill the giraffe for our saddle? Yeah, he's just freaking out. All right, you know what? You have to go. You have to go. I'm done with your, I'm done with your temper tantrum. All right. So we got our saddle back. Um, any more giraffes want to be my friend? I will try not to hit you and make you uh, very angry and upset.